Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on applying ordered pairs worksheet. So this video presents a worksheet on the topic of applying ordered pairs and we have two separate examples. So each of these examples has to be answered on a separate number plane. So one number plane for this whole example and a separate number plane for this one. So if you're not quite sure how to proceed, we've had a lesson on this very topic. And as always, just go to the next slide. There is a link for you. Click on the link, it will take you to the lesson and it will explain how to do each of these examples. So let's see what's required. Answer each of the following on a number plane. Number one. Plot the following points. So we have four points to plot. Number two. Join the dots from A to B to C to D and back to A again. When you do that, you actually form a closed shape. Next question, what shape is formed? Question four, how long is the base? Question five, how long is the height? And the last question, find the area in square units. So that's example one. The next example, question one, plot the following points. This time we have three points. We then have to follow this direction to join the points so we form a closed shape once again. Look closely at the shape and then answer what shape is formed? What is the name of the shape? How long is the base? How long is the perpendicular height? And find the area of the shape. So this video has given us a worksheet and it's on the topic of applying ordered pairs and it's very self-explanatory what you actually have to do. The directions are very straightforward but if you get, <coughs> sorry, if you get a little bit confused on the next slide there is a link. Click on the link, it will take you to the lesson and it will explain exactly how to do each one of these examples.